have been having problems with our number three gearbox, which is our number th on our number three pump. Uh, it's been going on now for about a, a year. It was a slight vibration, a little noise we was hearing. Uh, so we had a vibration analysis of it when we caught this sound. And the vibration analysis said it was an alignment issue. So we did have a company come in here after the vibration analysis and they lined it up the best they could with what they said it needs to be done. We put it back to work 14 hours. After the 14 hours of service of it running, it started vibrating tremendously. So we shut it down. And now we have contracted Philadelphia Gear for a turnkey operation where they're taking it out sent it to Birmingham, Alabama, and they are going to reinstall it and give us a three-year guarantee on it. This is a uh, Bradfoot gearbox. Uh, Philadelphia Gear is going to kind of reconverge it over to their style of gearbox, but it's going to work the same. If we ever have a problem again on any of the other gearboxes, they have the pattern to redo all five of them of this particular unit. Uh, number six and seven is different. We have seven pumps and gearboxes here that are working. Uh, six of them are working at the present time. Number three is out, of course. But our goal is to always have five running. That's what it was designed to work at. That's what we our goal is at all times. And how much water can, say, just one of these pumps, how much water can it move? One pump in by the manual uh, at 960 RPMs an hour will turn 448,800 gallons a minute. I'll round this off at half a million. So if all six of them are running, you're looking at three million. Fuel-wise, just to give you an idea of what it is, each pump burns 66 gallons an hour. When they say crank up, it's, that's what you're looking at. That's that, and plus a five-man, six-man crew, you know. If five pumps are running, it's 10,000 gallons that I will be ordering uh, every 24 hours. <laughs>